this is Thursday, February 1st. Beautiful here in Alabama today. Car is reading 46. I'm heading to one of my cleanings and I'm a bit early. So I figured, um, you know what? I saw pretty much everyone's comments from the video that I put out the other day where I said something about New Yorkers, please listen to this video. And if y'all listen to it, you know what? was said in that video. Okay, so let me just put this here. I, by no means, want to spread rumors, lies, false truths. I believe in keeping it real. Okay, so the question that I had on that video the other day when I said, if there's any New Yorkers that's listening into this, let me know, have you heard if it's true or not about what I talked about in that video? Well, Yaya commented back and said she went straight to see what new laws have been passed in New York. She said, I couldn't find anything. Thanks, Yaya, for doing that. I could have done that too. Um, but I didn't. Um, and Kathy even said, you know, I don't believe any of this. It's too far-fetched. Yes, it is very far-fetched. But here's the thing. There is a lot going on in this world today. Crazy is an understatement. There are crazy laws that have already been passed that we would never believe in all our years that these things would ever come to fruition. Okay. Uh, you know, our preacher says many times from the pulpit, talking about biblical things. And even as a preacher, he says, y'all, if I'm saying something from the pulpit and you either don't believe it, you don't know about it, you don't understand it, he said, be like the Bereans. Study to show thyself approved. Study it out. Search the scriptures daily as to whether or not these things are true or not. Well, we shouldn't only do that so far as biblical things are concerned, but everyday life situations. Yes, study, find out, do your research. You know, what is going on out there? Not so much that it would just overwhelm you or depress you or whatever just you know it's a good thing to know to know what's going on to know what to expect <clears throat> so um yeah there's that you know i don't want to be a negative nancy we got enough negativity in this world as there is but when I hear things, I'm curious, you know, like, is this so? And, um, I'm way too busy in my own life to, um, search out every little thing that you hear about. And God knows what we hear on the news, for the most part, is a bunch of lies. And I don't care what news station you listen to. But, we are in the last days and iniquity is coming to the full i mean it is almost to the brim it's almost overflowing so you know it's like i <clears throat> mentioned to kathy in the comment back to her facts sometimes are stranger than fiction it's always been that way but um you know we just got to stay focused on what's ahead of us and keep trusting God to get us through whatever we have to deal with in this life. And we know that crazier times are coming. No, most of us don't like to hear that, but it's the truth. Uh, I'm pulling off the side here because I am early for my cleaning this morning. I'm not supposed to be there till 10.30, and it's 20 till 10 right now, so 
I'm just gonna park right here and um but yeah and I'm sorry for you ladies that probably want to um get on YouTube for diversion and see something before instead of all this crap we have to put up day in and day out. Again, I am not trying to be negative Nancy. I just, I'm just expressing some thoughts here. That's all. And sometimes I do believe, like I said before, sometimes there are things that's, so far as I'm concerned, a little bit more important than makeup. There ain't no makeup on this face today, and I don't know if there will be, because after I get done with my cleaning here, or when I get there, I'll be back to my own house doing my own cleaning. Um, so, I just said what I wanted to say. And uh, um, maybe <clears throat> to throw a little, to get off all that depressing subject. Uh, I was driving before I started this video and I, there was a couple other things that I wanted to to mention and to shed a little bit of joy or whatever else that I possibly can here before I finish this video. Um, um, I, I don't know if anybody follows Rose. I do and I've been following her for over a year now and uh so rose if you see this kudos to you for having near 3000 subscribers that's wonderful keep up the work that you're doing because obviously you got a lot of people that really enjoy your channel and um yaya's doing really good on hers too um and so are a bunch of other ladies that i that i also follow uh but I'm just going to say it here, y'all, and I told y'all from the get-go, I am not on this channel to be a YouTube superstar, have millions of followers, that's just never going to happen, And uh, but for those ladies that enjoy doing what they're doing, and, they're getting, and their subscriptions are going up and up, high five to you, happy for you, because Speaking about Rose, I, I know she also started her channel for a bit of diversion, and it's brought her a lot of happiness and joy, and I will again encourage you to do the same, because we need diversion every now and then. Something just to get our minds off, and there's nothing wrong with getting our minds off this hair. There's nothing to get uh, uh, wrong about getting your mind off of things, and I'm sorry if I started off all negative and everything, but I just wanted to let y'all know, I am not here to promote lies, to promote rumors, to pr pr promote untruths. I just wanted, I was curious, and that's why I did that video the other day. But um, I do know that Angie Pruitt is doing a channel, and she also puts out scripture, and she talks about the love of the Lord, and how much he does in her life as well. And even if it's just getting on here and putting out Bible verses, Evelyn, um, and some of you other ladies out there, you know, if we need anything, we need Jesus. So there's that. And promoting Jesus is a wonderful thing. Promoting, because this world is screaming today, like our preacher also says, there's never been a time in history that the world is screaming for a savior. We need Christ Jesus. Everybody does. And so, yeah, you know, if you don't have a hobby or anything else to share, share Jesus. Because we need it. We need a lot of it. So, um, what else? What else? Uh, the little kitten is doing great. Cute as it can be. Um, what else? What else? What else? Mm, Elvis is doing good. We had a really good doctor's appointment the other day with the doctor that is pretty much, um, I don't know the word. We went to him because we thought he was holistic, but he's not holistic. 
he is kind of like that osposis, or I don't even know how to say that word. But he's technically a doctor that is, he doesn't, he's not there just to push pills. And we're sick of the doctors that just want to push pills. So, um, we're good on that note. And we have a follow-up in another six weeks. And, um, all's good there. Um, what else? What else? What else? Um... I don't know what else. Maybe I should just <coughs> from right here for right now. But uh, yeah, sickness, um, NASCAR, Allison said uh, her school closed down where her kids go to school the other day because there were so many kids sick in school. So they shut it down for a day or so. Yep, sickness is running rampant down here too. Everybody you talk to is either been sick sick or just getting over it so yeah it's it's crazy down here um what else weather is beautiful i hope it stays this way um my mind is blank folks so i guess when my mind is blank may as well jump off here and um maybe get go ahead and to my house cleaning and maybe she'll let me come on in and get started 30 minutes earlier than what I'm supposed to be there and get it done so I can get back and take care of my own stuff. Yep, lots going on in Becky's world, but then I ain't in this boat by myself. I know there's a lot going on in yours, but we gotta stay in tune with God, read his word, study his word, pray, and keep believing. So, uh, this is Thursday, new month, and we should all keep each other in prayers and uh, look to God to take care of whatever we have to deal with day in and day out. And always, there's a reason to be thankful. Where if you're watching this, you're living today. God's given you another day as he has me and let's live it that it live it to where we can bring him honor and glory because if anybody deserves that the one who loved us first definitely does okay so that's it folks hope to hear back from you and uh yes i will try to get a makeup video because i know this is where this channel started but you know it's gone from makeup to pets to cooking to ranting. And uh, I'm Becky A to Z. Okay? So y'all have a great day and we will try and catch you later. See ya.